This is an old Honda XR500. I'm doing some work on it. One of the unusual features about this engine is it's got a reed valve. So a reed valve four-stroke engine. And before I put the carburetor back on, I've got the uh, video camera out and uh, I wanted to show that this engine is in fact equipped with a reed valve. Right in there. This engine it has a four valve head, two intake and two exhaust valves. However, the engine as I was showing earlier also has the addition of the reed valve. So my understanding is what Honda was trying to do was improve the low end power on uh, the engine. So uh, way back when I was about 15 years old, I had a 79 XR500. That was the uh, twin shock version, twin shock rear suspension. And uh, from what I remember, that bike, it had uh, the low end power was fine. Also, what I understand is that the reed valve on uh, this engine, this, so that I think this is 81 and 82 that they uh, had the reed valve. So what it can actually do is restrict the airflow as the uh, airflow is uh, increased. So possibly already in the mid-range and uh, likely in the top end, the uh, power has actually uh, diminished somewhat. So uh, exactly when that would start or how much, that I, I, I don't know. It's a bit of speculation, but I think it's some, uh, <laughs> some common sense logic, I, I think, applies there as well. So I'm not an expert on all that, but uh, a little bit uh, from what I've read and uh, some of my uh, own personal input into that as well. So I'd be curious what this engine would do with the reed valve removed and uh, see how it uh, how the engine uh, what kind of power it makes like that and then also what would it do if it had uh, larger uh, exhaust i don't it, it just seems like it looks they, they look small for that size of a cylinder but then there's also the, uh, the the cooling fins which make the cylinder actually look bigger than it actually is anyways so figured i would uh, show that before I get that carburetor back on there. Anyways guys, thanks for checking out another video.